guys. We're back with part two of the San Diego trip. Let's continue where we left off. Dad, I'm gonna place my body through that racket. Could you toss it right here for me? Thank you. Are you mad? Come on. Whoa. So where do you guys work? Now guys, look, I normally quit eating about three hours before the show, just so I can do this stunt. Right now I'm so hungry. Could eat that child crawling right there. Get off my rope, kid. That's mine. One, two. Everybody clap like this. Clap, clap, clap. You guys just hold that right there. Do me a favor, guys. Part like Moses. Good, you read your Bibles. Clap, 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 clap. Everybody look up here. It's the finale! I'll get out of the way. I really don't know what you all expected. I just see a job. Someone make sure I'm um, I grab my cell phone wherever it's at. It's probably in the box. I don't need Facebook messages all day. It's your turn, sir. <laughs> Grab it, man. What's your name? <laughs> Doug. I'll be you, Doug. Grab it right there. Grab it under my leg with the other hand. Doug, do not pull. All right? I'll be you, one. Doug. Oh. <laughs> I think Doug's a good sport, but I am not Doug, okay? Guys, give Doug a round of applause. He's a good sport, right? Oh, thank you, thank you. Doug, can you grab this end for me, Doug? Doug, just stand over there in that corner. Think about what you've done. <laughs> Grab this end for me, Sean. Go stand over there just like, like he is. I'm going to pin my arms down to my chest just like this. Keep going around my body, guys. Do not worry about hurting me. I'm married. Pulling it really tight. As tight as you guys can get it. Just like that. Everybody yell tighter. Tighter. <laughs> Doug, what did you do? Right. Just, just stop. It sounds like a horse race. There it is. No, don't clap yet. It's still around my waist. <laughs> Doug, just hop on the unicycle. <laughs> Do me a favor. You can lift heavy. Guys, grab me by my elbows. Push me up on one, two, or whatever you want to do. Okay. Jonathan, help them. Help them. Hold it tight, guys. Don't let the unicycle go. Get out of the way, guys. One, two, let go. No hesitation. Three! <laughs> this is it! <laughs> Are you guys still with me? So yeah! yeah. There it is, guys. I'm going to show you guys how to travel with a seven foot unicycle and a suitcase. It's going to be pretty crazy. I'll show you guys how I do it. Grab your screwdriver, or your wrench. <laughs> if I showed you this yet, that was a funny show. So, oh, wait. And you just unscrew it. And then you undo all these things. And this unicycle is made specifically for traveling. Get the chain off. You place all your, your bars down, your crankshaft, this guy goes right there, and 
normally supposed to do this with gloves, so you're not filthy. Thanks for, for recording this, George. I appreciate you. You guys should clap for George. Give him a thumbs up. Comment. Thanks, George. Yeah, I'm, I'm talking to the people on YouTube. It's all good. And that is how you travel with a seven foot unicycle. It's pretty dope. And your wrench. Don't forget your screwdriver. All right, you can cut it. All right, guys, that's it for part two. We got part three coming next week. Stay tuned. See you guys then.